Let's take a look back at the first two weeks in Oberlin College Athletics. The men's soccer team is off to a hot start, winning four of its first five matches, which includes an 8-0 thrashing of Waynesburg and a 4-1 win over Earlham College this past week. Senior John Ingham posted 12 points with five goals and two assists en route to earning NCAC Player of the Week honors, in addition to being tabbed as a National Soccer Coaches Association Player of the Week. The Yo women started off a little slow, but have won their last two matches, dismantling Waynesburg 8-1 before blanking Defiance 4-0. Ten different players have scored so far this year, led by sophomore Gwenny Gardner with three goals. The field hockey team has shown signs of improvement thus far, scoring in three of its first four games. Junior Maureen Coffey has netted two of the team's tallies on the year. The Yeoman football team is 1-1, most recently downing rival Kenyon College 28-24 for its first ever win in the Austinian Old Athletics Complex. NCAC Player of the Week Blake Buchanan rushed for a career-high 153 yards and a touchdown, while Justin Cruz added his second score of the year. Junior linebacker Justin Butte was named to the D3Football.com Team of the Week for his 15-tackle performance against the Lords. Oberlin's cross-country teams have impressed through two meets, which included last weekend's NCAC preview meet, where the men's team finished first and the women were second. Both medals were in the crimson and gold as senior Gino Arthur took the top spot in the men's 5K, while classmate Sarah Lois was the women's winner en route to earning NCAC Runner of the Week honors. The volleyball team has notched a pair of early season wins, taking down Alfred in the Roach. Sophomore Claudia Scott is off to a quick start with 72 kills over five matches, while Krista Langens has dropped in 17 aces. That's your update. Go Yo!